Welcome to the channel. Today we're looking at the top 4K movies that are only available in digital. Right now there are a lot of 4K movies that are only available for digital purchase. For whatever reason, studios are not releasing many of their films on physical disc. This means that the only way to get a 4K copy of some movies is by getting it in digital. Starting the list with one of the best, Live, Die, Repeat, Edge of Tomorrow. The 4K in this movie is reference quality and what some would call demo worthy. This is a Tom Cruise and Emily Blunt movie. Both are excellent here. This does have HDR, Dolby Vision, and Dolby Atmos. This movie will likely make anyone's list for top 4K movies that are only available on digital. If you haven't picked this up yet, I highly recommend doing so. Next, we have X-Men Days of Future Past, The Rogue Cut. Days of Future Past is available on 4K disc, but The Rogue Cut is only available on 4K digital. To me, this is the definitive version of the movie. Is it on the same level as a Snyder Cut of a movie? Not really, but it does add some extra depth to the film with an extra 17 minutes of runtime. The 4K here is very sharp. It also has beautiful HDR. There are some dark scenes, but you don't miss any of the detail with this excellent 4K transfer. This was overall a great movie, but I do wish they added a little more development to their minor characters like Blink, Warpath, Bishop, or Colossus. Here we have Underwater, and it is another great movie in 4K. There is an excellent use of HDR throughout, and this comes in Dolby Vision on Apple. So I recommend if you pick it up, get it there. This is another movie where there are a lot of dark scenes, but I didn't notice any loss of detail with Crushed Blacks. I'm typically not into Kristen Stewart movies, but I do think she did a good job here. Okay, next we have The Man From U.N.C.L.E. If you haven't seen this movie yet, do yourself a favor and get this. Not only is this an excellent action comedy, but it is a beautiful 4K HDR and Dolby Vision transfer that is only available for digital purchase. You will also be happy to hear that it does have an Atmos track. I think this is one of the best movies with an amazing cast of Henry Cavill, Alicia Vikander, and Army Hammer. Don't sleep on this one, pick this movie up. Next we have Star Trek The Wrath of Khan, the director's cut. There is probably some here that didn't even know this movie came in 4K. At the time of making this video, you can't get any other of the original Star Trek movies in 4K. So some scenes are very sharp and take full advantage of the 4K transfer, while other scenes can appear a little soft. This movie also has HDR. Right now you can only pick up this movie on Vudu or Fandango now, but if I remember correctly, only Vudu has the 4K with HDR. Here we have Total Recall. So this is not the original Arnold Schwarzenegger film, this is the remake that came out in 2012 with Colin Farrell, Jessica Biel, and Kate Beckinsale. This is a highly detailed 4K digital transfer, but with this being a sci-fi movie, it could have really benefited from adding some HDR. This is still the best way to watch this movie, and I do recommend it. Batman Ninja. What makes this movie great is that it's Batman and he's a ninja. What else do you really need to know? Other than that though, the art style here is so detailed that a 4K transfer was really necessary and it does take full advantage of this with HDR and Dolby Vision. Next on this list, The Wolverine. This is definitely one of the top 4K movies only available in digital. You cannot get this on physical disc. I'm all for building a physical collection of your favorite 4K movies, but don't miss out on these digital exclusives. And if you have seen the other X-Men 4K transfers, this is no exception. You will appreciate how sharp and detailed this transfer is as well. Here we have the James Bond collection. So right now you can only get the Daniel Craig collection on physical disc. If you want to see Sean Connery, Roger Moore, Pierce Bronson, and a couple other lesser known James Bond in 4K, you can only get these digitally. I saw some of these movies when I was younger, so I may be Pierce Bronson or maybe even a little Roger Moore old, but I'm not Sean Connery old, so this was the first time watching a lot of these movies, and I am so glad that I did. The 4K transfers are excellent, and the only thing missing in this collection is HDR, but there is no better way to watch these movies right now, so I do recommend picking them up when you can get them in a discount bundle. 
Here are a few other 4K movies that may be worth checking out that are only available on digital. Thanks for watching and let me know in the comment section what your top 4K movies are that are only available for digital purchase. Before we go, if you want to see how to build your digital movie library for the lowest cost possible, click the link in this video. Also look for my next video where I show my complete digital movie collection.